All right. You've got two blades to work with, so you got to get them square. Okay, so there's a little a bit little of skill hard. involved. So, hopefully, what are you going to power this with? Hydraulics. Well, hydraulics, so. but what are you going to use for a motor to Twenty system? There's a power cube we're using, which is 27 horsepower power unit. They'll be sharing the power between the main blade and the secondary blade. Crank mechanism with a gear rack for moving the whole carriage side to side. And then the up and down mechanism, a worm gear connected to the other side. Whoa, look at that. Plug and play design, simple modularity, designed for lifetime. That's beautiful. The implications are that we can localize lumber production. So right now, lumber comes from all over the world through global supply chains. Now, if everybody had access to something like that on a scale of regions or cities, then lumber could be produced locally again, and therefore people would be much more concerned about their the rainforests or their own forests, and the rainforests could be saved more, I think. The general concept is that if, if people see that production occurs on a local level, we don't have to go to the global supply chains which are typically irresponsible. So this is about localizing, making, making industry more responsible with this example, that being lumber production from trees that are all around. So there's going to be many, many issues on this, but as a first prototype, that's satisfactory. Mm -hmm.